Let's face it, the headphone jack is going away. Companies don't really care what we want. The Pixel hasn't had it since the Pixel 2, the OnePlus 60 dropped it, and there are rumors that Samsung might remove it from the Note 10 next year. The point is, USB-C earphones seem to be the only option for people unwilling to buy a Bluetooth headset. But what options do we have? Hey guys, I'm Akshay from Bebomb.com and today I'm going to tell you about the best USB-C earphones to buy in India. But before we get started, it's been some time and I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys are new here. So how about you hit the bell icon to get notified every time we post an awesome new video. Now that you've done that, let's get started. Okay, so when I started looking for a pair of USB-C earphones in India, I realized that there simply aren't a lot of choices out there. I mean, there's the OnePlus Bullets USB-C earphones, the Mi Type-C earphones and the Pixel 3 USB-C earbuds which aren't even available separately and that's pretty much it. I know, Amazon and Flipkart show up a bunch of USB-C earphones but most of these are from unknown companies with really average ratings. That's not really what I was looking for but still, we decided to check out three of these cheap earphones to see what they're actually like. So the first ones we tested were these Mimob Pure Bass earbuds that are priced at just Rs 399. Okay, so the first thing that came into my mind while using these earphones was the fact that they sound pretty good, especially for a 400 rupees pair of earphones. The bass is punchy and it gets loud, so yeah, it's decent enough. True, the build quality here isn't all that great, but that's not something I was expecting at its price. Anyway, when it comes to compatibility, I know you would expect USB-C earphones to just work with every USB-C phone, but that's not the case. In my testing, these worked with the OnePlus 60 and the Mi A2, but they did not work with the Note 9 and the Poco F1. So the compatibility here is kind of a mixed bag. However, the biggest problem with these earphones is that they're just not comfortable to use. Within a few minutes of using them, my ears started hurting, so there's just no way I can recommend these. Next up, we had the Wonderford earphones digital lossless. Ugh. These earphones that kind of look like the sort of earphones that Samsung used to pack with its devices back in the day. The best part about these earphones, other than their 260 rupees price, is that instead of volume buttons, they have a volume slider, which personally I thought was really cool. I haven't really seen that in earphones so far. But that's the only good thing about these earphones. The sound quality here is just not good enough. I mean, the volume gets high, but the treble is just ridiculously bad. So much that it gets annoying. You know, I would have forgiven all of that because, come on, rupees 260 earphones. But the damn things have a USB-C plug that screwed up the port on my OnePlus 5. Seriously, it doesn't even charge properly anymore and that's why I did not check their compatibility with other phones. Just stay away from these earphones. Lastly, we had the LETV Type-C earphones priced at Rs 670 and these are actually decent enough. I mean, the build quality here is pretty good and feels sturdy and nice and the sound quality is also good enough for the price. They get really loud and the sound feels balanced enough, however, they do tend to distort at higher volumes and the sound leaks out of them a lot, which can be annoying. That said, for earphones that are priced at around Rs 600, these are ones you can buy if you're looking for really cheap USB-C earphones. Plus, they work with almost every phone we tested them on, including the OnePlus 60, the Note 9 and the Poco F1. They didn't, however, work on the Mi A2. So it's pretty obvious that most cheap USB-C earphones available online just aren't good enough. Yeah, the LETV earphones are decent and you can buy them if you're looking for USB-C earphones in the 500 to 600 rupees price range, but even they aren't as good as the earphones with a regular 3.5 mm jack in this price. Anyway, coming to earphones I would actually recommend, first up we have the OnePlus Bullets Type-C earphones. Priced at Rs 1500 and these are really pretty damn impressive. For one, the build quality here is great. True, I would have loved a braided cable, but this is good enough for the price. Plus, the sound quality here is awesome. Truly awesome. The bass is punchy and deep, the highs and mids are balanced very well and the earphones are comfortable to wear as well. I love these and I like the fact that they work with most phones I tested, except for the Mi A2. Overall, for Rs 1500, these are the best USB-C earphones you can get right now in India. There are also the Mi Type-C earphones priced at Rs 3000 and if you remember, we even made a video on them. So yeah, they've been around for some time now and they're pretty good. For starters, the build quality is impeccable here and there's a braided cable as well which is a really nice touch from Xiaomi and I really appreciate that. I find these earphones to be very comfortable even for long use and I really like their sound quality as well. 
there's ample bass, they get loud and they don't distort. I still prefer the audio on the OnePlus Bullets mode but these are really good earphones too. Plus they come with active noise cancellation as well and I find that really useful when people are being noisy and I need to work. Xiaomi mentions that they only support the Mi 5 and the Mix 2 but we tested them with the OnePlus 5, the OnePlus 60, the P20 Pro, the Poco F1 and other phones and they worked fine. Ironically though, they did not work with the Mi A2 which is just weird. There are also the Google Pixel Type-C earbuds which are quite honestly the best ones out of all of these but they're not available in India unless, you know, you buy the Pixel 3. That sucks but these do not. At just $30 which is around 2000 rupees, these earphones are just amazing. I love the sound quality on them, the bass is great and the highs and lows are perfect. These are by far the best sounding USB-C earphones I have ever tried and I love them. Plus they have some really cool Google Assistant features. I can just press hold this button here to talk to the assistant and ask it questions and stuff. I can also have the assistant read out my notifications straight into my ear and press hold the volume up button to even reply to them. It's pretty cool and it's not like this only works with the Pixel. We tested this on other phones with Android Pie and these features worked out perfectly. On most non-Android Pie phones, the earphones are compatible except the Mi A2 so that's great. By the way, if you're wondering, we did reset the Mi A2 in the hope that these earphones work with it, but they did not. Coming back to the Pixel USB-C earbuds, let me just put it this way. The Pixel 3 might be overpriced, but the Pixel USB-C earbuds are definitely not. I really hope Google brings them to India soon, but we contacted Google and they did not have a clear answer on when we can expect them in India. So that's slightly disappointing. So as you can see, the USB-C earphones market in India is pretty much restricted to just two good USB-C earphones, the OnePlus Bullets and the Mi Type-C earphones. But that's not the case in other countries. If you take a look at the US, there are quite a lot of great USB-C earphones available to buy. There's the Razer Hammerhead USB-C earphones, the JBL Reflect Aware USB-C earphones, the Essential USB-C earphones, the HTC Usonic and a lot more. Look, the point is USB-C is the future and it's important that we in India have options when it comes to buying USB-C earphones. Anyway, right now, which are the best USB-C earphones to buy in India? Look, the Pixel USB-C earbuds are outrightly the best USB-C earphones out there, but they are not available in India. So the second best here are the OnePlus Bullets Type-C earphones, which bring great sound quality at a really affordable price of 1500 rupees. Other than that, the Mi Type-C earphones are pretty great too, especially because they bring active noise cancellation, which is really handy for noisy situations and it's something that is not available in any other USB-C earphones in India. However, they are priced at Rs 3000, so yeah, you'll have to shell out a bit extra. Lastly, if you're looking for super cheap USB-C earphones, the LETV Type-C earphones at around Rs 600 are your only decent option. Well, that was our video on the best USB-C earphones to buy in India. Personally, I really like the OnePlus Bullets, but if the Pixel earphones were available in India, I would buy them for sure. But what do you think about the state of USB-C earphones in India? Let us know in the comments down below. Also, give this video a like and share it with your friends who are looking to buy new USB-C earphones. Lastly, subscribe to our channel for more amazing tech videos. That's me signing off. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.